Previously on Danganronpa 2. I mean, I want to make everyone, everyone in your group feel despair. That includes you, stupid. Did I have a flying fruity fuck about you? You look at Nagi from the last game. That makes me automatically hate your stupid punk ass. I am gonna fucking murder you. And now back to the island. Hello. This is Nico B. Back with some more Danganronpa 2. We last left off with your god dang the saddest fucking trial ever. <laughs> It was so sad. It was so sad because it was a character I really cared about a lot, you know? I mean, I... And someone I really just didn't expect to be one of the killers, you know? Someone... I, I didn't expect him to, to kill anybody, whatever, you know? It just... It really shocked me. God, it was off this trial, too. It was, it was trial two all over again. Man, I am just sucking balls this game and calling this shit. Like, <laughs> I thought I was pretty good at, at guessing stuff, but man, this game has proved me all, all kinds of wrong. But, you know, it's, I don't know, at the same time, at least it's, it's nice, you know, and it's, uh, there, you know, that this game can still surprise me, so, uh, anyway, uh, so I haven't really had a chance to talk about this, because you guys might have noticed that a lot of times I'll, I'll record, like, a long session and split it into multiple parts, I usually do that for the trials, but, uh, so, yeah, I was gonna talk about, I wanna talk to you guys about the, the comments, so, yeah, you, you, I'm sure you all noticed I turned the comments off, um, for the past few videos. My plan was to turn them off and... Uh, until the I finished a trial and then I was gonna turn it back on again just for that the end of the trial but I did that in this last I did that in the last episode episode 34 um, and uh, a number you said you just were like no don't do it don't do it turn it off again you just like begged me to disable them again because apparent apparently the chapter five and six apparently there's two there's still two chapters left holy fucking shit this game goes on goes on forever um but Apparently, it's like infamous for people just coming in and wanting to spoil the shit out of those two chapters. That's what you guys said. And you said you'd rather have the comments off and that it not be spoiled than me living on me actually being spoiled or whatever. So, um, I, I want to say I'm sort of proud of you guys. I'm, I'm, I, the response to the, me turning off the, I was expecting this huge backlash, you know, like we're just being like, oh, fuck, the comments are all blah, blah, blah. But you guys have been really cool about it. And I really appreciate that. I'm not happy about turning the comments off. I mean, but, but I'm, I'm sort of proud of you guys. You guys are really cool about this. So, uh, thanks. Thanks for being supportive with it. It's not something I wanted to do, but I think you guys are probably right. So it's probably better just to, especially since we're kind of getting close to the end anyway, right? So, God, I'm already like, thir I'm 30, what, 34 episodes into this? I think I've already beat, I think I've already surpassed the others, the Danganronpa 1 series in term of, terms of number of videos. Like, jeez, like this is like coming one of my longest series. But, uh, anyway, alright, let's continue where we left off. After being released from the funhouse, we went back to living our less than ordinary lives. And just like before, our day began with all of us gathering at the restaurant. God, we are down to the nitty gritty, though. You know, <laughs> the time we meet up here, it makes me realize just how crazy this whole situation was. Remember when everybody was here? Remember when Terry Terry was here over, the, over there grabbing? <laughs> Grabbing Sonya's boobies and stick his head up Samiki's ass. Oh man, those are the good old days. Remember when I didn't have have an eye patch on? Remember those days? Remember when I used to be a jackass to everybody? That was me pre eye patch. Um, the restaurant certainly feels more spacious than before. Of course, it feels spacious. There are less than half of us here now than there were at the beginning. Stupid fool. What? <laughs> Stupid fool, get it together. <laughs> was that what? Nakamura bot. Huh? Oh my! Huh? Did you hear something? Hey! It, it's Nick Ma. That was Coach Nick Ma's voice. Huh? What are you? What are you talking about? He's no longer. What's up? <laughs> what are you laughing about? I'll be the crap out of you. Coach me out like that. Oh, uh, what did he do? Make like a fake Nick Ma or something? <laughs> hey, that's not cool. I was all up all night working my fingers to the bone. I am concerned. More importantly, I'm starting to get tired of the seasonings in this restaurant. <laughs> <laughs> this food. <laughs> yeah, this food sucks. All I got is bagels. Bagels suck. He just comes running in. W what did you say, Kuzuru? What did you say? I just said the, the bagels are getting cut. Don't you ever say that ever again. I will fucking shove my hope down your fucking throat. Never diss the bagels. Never! You hear me, Kuzuru? Okay, I'm sorry. Jesus Christ. Kameda grabs like 30 bagels and runs away. All right, I'm gone now. Hey, Kameda, away! Seriously, I'm, I'm starting to realize how valuable Tater Tater was. <laughs> I don't ignore me. I'm trying to talk about something important. Huh? Important? All right. <laughs> you? <laughs> Listen, took me, took me all night to make it. 
Hey, it's me! It's Mini Nikamaru! <laughs> and I've got. <laughs> my! Is that a Nikamaru doll? I'm Mini Mario! Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god, I totally call that shit Mini Mario! <laughs> That's awesome! Mini Mario? Holy shit, it's fucking adorable! Look at it! Oh god! I think it's awesome to make it. What do you think? Awesome quality, right? <laughs> Of course, it doesn't have free will or anything, so it's more like, you know, a toy. Huh? But isn't it freaking adorable? Are you oh. serious? Oh! Oh! Thanks. It's so cute! Thanks, I'll keep it! <laughs> well. <laughs> oh, thank God, you're about to murder me. Oh, I never said anything about giving it away. I'll you up. Don't be so stuck up! Your stuff is, st my, your stuff is my stuff, right? Whoa! Whoa, hey now, that's a bully, that's a bully logic! Give it to me! Give it to me! <laughs> Well, it doesn't matter. I made this to cheer you guys up anyway. Mm. And as long as we have it, we won't forget, you know? How about Nakamura sacrifice for us? And it also helps wake you up in the morning. <laughs> hey, hey, get up, stupid. What are you doing sleeping when you should be out there doing push-ups? You lazy good for nothing. Ah, <laughs> damn it. But, but Mini Mar, I, I'm not feeling so good. <laughs> That's no excuse. Get out of here, you lazy asshole. <laughs> he picks me up and throws me out the door. <laughs> oh my god, Mini Mar, no. Stay here today because of him. So we're... we're we're gonna prevent something like that from ever happening. Engine's ready. I guess we gotta fight too, right? We can't just keep running away. Damn, we got I me. Mean, we got two chapters to wrap this shit up. Come on. There's not many of us left. I gotta admit, never thought I'd hear you say something that awesome. Like, really? <laughs> <laughs> hey, of course. I keep it all bottled in. I wait for the right moment. Um, in the end, Gundam told, told us to never give up on life. I. So I will never give up. I shall fight until the very end. <laughs> Gundam, please watch over me. Miss Aww. Sonia? Uh, Miss Sonia, what do you think of my little pet doll? Oh my! Oh, did you say something? <laughs> Are you kidding me? <laughs> what? I was up all night memorizing that speech! Damn it! <laughs> do you have any idea how much I had to plagiarize for that? <laughs> May I take away our clothes? They'll never take away our bagels! Oh wait, no. Wait, that's not what I wrote down. <laughs> and then Kameda strikes again. <laughs> and he flies out the window. Damn it, Kameda! Jeez. I feel, I feel bad for... I kind of feel bad though, like... Like, Sonya just doesn't give a shit about Kazuichi. Uh, so wait, what happened to hamsters? That's why I, f I feel like bad. What are they gonna do? I was hoping we'd see them. Like, somebody would be taking care of them. And there's a bunch of like. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I really like this. Thanks, Kazuichi. You're always good for comical relief. I am Mini Maru. <laughs> <laughs> you want a piece of this? You want a piece of this, Mini Maru? Let's go! Going down! Bring it on, big tits! I'm only half as happy to be thinking about That's you. That's right. Oh, by the way, you can also use that mu massage. Massage your solar muscles and pressure balls. Are you serious? Are you serious? Oh, that's amazing. Mm, I'm gonna start with my boobies right now. She rips her shirt off and starts rubbing her boobs with it. Well, oh my god, I should have made that a long time ago. Of course. Of course, I made it after all. <laughs> oh, seriously, thanks. I'll take good care of it. Kind of looks really happy. Hey, that's hey. good. <laughs> hey, hey. <laughs> anyway, what happened? What happened to Kameda? I haven't seen him like I usually do. <laughs> You don't want to worry about that guy. He goes solo all the freaking time. Wow. He's probably, probably plotting shit, gonna murder us somehow. Still, I, I'm a little worried about how he was acting in the last class trial. Well, he's always been a dangerous bastard, but he's crossed the line, you know. Hey, hey. That's a like more reason we should avoid him. But still, but if we should, we sh we do avoid him. What are you going to do if he approaches us? I guess suddenly, sudden change was really weird. I wonder, did he figure something out that we're not aware of? Now then. Yeah, that, that's. I don't know what he learned. What, what could he possibly learn? Are we not ultimates? Is that like... But we are, aren't we? Like, he's... The only thing I can think of is that we're not ultimates or something. Like, everybody isn't. Because he treats everybody like... He's treating everybody like shit. Uh, anyway, I it's about time you told us what that was all about. Oh, yeah. Huh? That? Hmm. You know what? Now I can do is during the trap. <clears throat> you still don't realize. Jeez, get together. You're supposed to be the symbols of hope, aren't you? Man, you all sung big donkey balls. <laughs> I forgot, except for Hajime, of course. <laughs> ah, ah, damn it. Bastard. What do you mean by except Hajime? Huh? Are you really a traitor after all? You don't get to play my mini Maru. Huh? Oh, it's not like that, you fucking idiot. <laughs> really? I don't want to say it, but I guess I have no choice. Uh, tell you guys the truth. I'm like the rest of you. Uh, well, apparently, I was never part of Hope's Be Aca Hope's Be Academy's primary department. I'm a reserve course student from the reserve department. Huh? Reserve department? The fuck is that? It means unlike you guys, I don't have an ultimate talent at all. Even though I've been doing all the fucking work. You guys have been doing shit. I'm the ultimate erection head. 
Apparently, I'm just a normal person. <laughs> I'm the ultimate hoge. <laughs> I I hoge ho hoge. Okay, I think I say say that all. Uh, well, that's it, dude. Don't ever scare me like that. It's not something I just brush off. It's just since it's about me. I thought I just forgot. I thought I got the hoax speaking out of me because I had a talent all along. But shit, <laughs> shit. My whole life, I just wanted to feel more confident about myself, and I thought like, getting into Hoaxie Academy meant I'd finally become someone I could be proud of. But not some fucking backup student. Fuck that shit. I'm fucking Hajime, bitch. I've got Johnny on Bosch voicing me. I can't just be the ult. I can't be some reserve backup student. Right? Cheer up, Hajime. It doesn't matter if you're from the reserve department. Of course. She is right. No matter what, you are our friend. See, you guys are all fucking awesome. Like, fuck Amita and his little, little nasally fucking voice, bitch. <laughs> no, there is a saying in Japan. Fear is grateful for the danger. Hey. What the hell are you saying that all wrong? <laughs> Oh my god! Ah! I don't understand! How are you bleeding, Monami? <laughs> ah, we saw everyone was here! Oh, holy balls! I'm guessing you defeated another... Yeah, one of the Mana Beasts? Is, it, is this the last one? Second to last one? I don't know. That one really was a... That one really had a hard time getting da going down! <laughs> it is, isn't it? It was a real close battle! I apologize. I was trying to cheer you up, but I ended up saying the wrong thing. <laughs> <laughs> well, it doesn't matter. Sometimes it's hard to say sometimes. Huh? huh? That's weird. Maybe you can see me. <laughs> Whoa, what the heck? You're covered in blood. Holy balls. You look like me. <laughs> oh, you saw me. Yes, that's right. The Mona Beast this time was a very strong one. Oh, my God. <laughs> Holy balls. Get ready. Get ready for level 4, Nico. That shit's going to fuck your shit. Yeah. Oh, boy. Rose, don't get close to me! Get out of here! No gratitude, I'm being treated like Phil! <laughs> oh, it's okay, Monami. I'm proud of you for being a mom beast. I don't know how the fuck you're doing it. I, I, I'm i looking forward to playing that minigame just so I can figure out how the hell you're doing it. What are you hey, doing hey. to them? Hey, hey, why don't you clean that blood off? We're trying to eat. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes, I'm ashamed of myself. How ever so mean to Monami? <laughs> wipe, wipe, wipe. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Now then, allow me to rot you all once again. A previous battle that's never been seen in history. I finally succeeded in conquering the last Mona Beast. Oh, it was the last one. Yeah, the thing is, I actually thought this was the last chapter, but you guys said apparently there's two left. So, because I, I was like, oh yeah, this is the last Mona Beast. Apparently, there's one more after that. What, wasn't the last? Wasn't the first game only five chapters? <laughs> because of this is finally possible for you to travel to the final island. Island. Uh, I see. <laughs> what an reaction! It's like I'm surrounded by tons of shabu shabu from all you can eat restaurant. What, <laughs> what are you talking? I don't know what that is, Monami. Um, um, don't tell me this again. You're gonna see stuff like it's not like we can get off this island. Why bother going to the new island? Well, it's true. I don't, I don't really expect much. Don't misunderstand. But who said we weren't gonna go? I also we're gonna go, dumbass. We might have another roller coaster, and another fun house. That sounds somewhat like so much fun. Uh huh. So we think about run away was a mistake. Cause we got a one hand room, we got a full fight! Bow one fight! Oh yeah! I'll crush everyone who's, who put, through, put us through this crap one blow! Hey, hey! Uh, seriously? Fearsome group is called World Ender for a reason, you know? What are you saying? I. Did you forget what you said earlier? Hey, hey, hey! Don't ask, I was thinking I was trying to impress Miss Sonya. I want to get in her panties. I want. Hydra's the one who's getting everybody's underwear. What about me? What about Kazuichi's underwear? Now nah, I don't really want your underwear, Hydra. No, I meant this hard's underwear for me. Damn it! What? <laughs> don't brag about it. Settle down. <laughs> if you have the if you have the power to fight amongst yourself, then direct that power toward our enemy. All right. <laughs> I like when she grabs her arm like that. Like she's like, oh yes, mm, check out these muscles, baby. Then let us go forth. Offense is the best of the defense. Damn right. D damn right! <laughs> because, <laughs> damn right! <laughs> I love, I love that voice actor. He, he's so good. <laughs> You're right. Now's not time for us to be bickering about horse shit. <laughs> Man, I don't really get it. But when Miss Sonya talks like that, my blood starts to boil. My penis gets hard. All right. <laughs> All right. I'm getting pumped up. Let's try our way to that new island. Oh, oh, oh. To get up. Huge foundation. Mon Monokuma, Mon Monami. Of course, them all at once. <laughs> Even me. But you know these things for you guys. <laughs> Why Monami though? She's like, I still don't think Monami's a bad guy. I, I think she is part of the, the foundation, but I I think I think she's 
She wants to keep us on this island because she doesn't want us to see the shitty world, I think. I, I'm still convinced about that. <laughs> you guys seem reliable. You don't talk like you're not included. Like you're not included. You're our friend too, you know. Mm, you're right. Leave it to me. Then I got to my best too. Nee. As we left the restaurant, the expressions on our faces were clearly different than they were before. They were filled with wi strong will and determination. On with that, I began walking toward the last island. But the clouds in my heart still lingered. I couldn't stop thinking about the reserve department. That filled me with this strange and comfortable feeling like bone, like a small bone was lodged in my throat. But I tried to think about it. I tried to stay focused on moving forward. What is it about it that... Ooh! That's a, that was kind of freaky looking. Smile at hope in the name of despair. Daily life. Jesus Christ, what was that? That was a scary looking, look like a mangled version of Monokuma. Like a, <laughs> you know, like he'd be one of those little uh, mascots that show up in <laughs> Five Nights at Freddy's. With the Monobis go, we across the fifth bridge and right at the final island. Oh, all right, we're just skipping right to it. Holy. So this is the last island. What the fuck? Am I in steampunk town? <laughs> oh, they got a lot of cranes. What in the fuck? What is up with that building to the right there? Look at that. Is that even, it looks like an MC Escher painting or something. Most buildings towered everywhere, as if the entire island were one gigantic city. It felt very sci-fi, so the island was a snapshot of an urban metropolis from the near future. I guess it has an ambiance befitting of a final island. <laughs> Why don't we just come to this island first? Oh, oh, I'm watching you! I see you, Hajime! Objection! Objection, motherfucker! <laughs> Who's he talking to? I'm talking to you, Hadrian. I see you standing there with your big pudgy head. Come, notice me. <laughs> notice me, Senpai. <laughs> hey, don't start that shit again. All right, well, we got some Vendor Street. All right. Ooh. Ooh, I'm going to get me some. I'm going to get me some PF Changs. <laughs> mm, oh. Oh. Mm, yummy, yummy. Okay, now, are you a doll? Oh, come on. I got to be able to click on. Okay, good. Hidden Marakuma! I just realized, fuck, I still can't go to the I got. Hopefully, this time I don't get trapped in a fucking building again. I can actually go and uh, explore. Try to see if I can get that Monokuma plushie in uh, Sionji's room. I gotta complete my collection! Hey, Kuzuru. Hey, I was wondering who, who was lured here by smell. I expected Connie, though, not you. I wasn't lured by the smell or anything. Anyway. Looks like that street's full of vendors. For food vendors, but as you can see, there's no customers, there's a staff. Huh, only the food's here. Oh, all right, it's actual, there's actually food here, all right. Let's, I'm really sure like this would be bustling with activity if there's no one there, here. It's actually pretty creepy to think about. Uh, really, there's nothing to examine except for these fucking cameras again? Oh, by the way, let's check. Hey, how you doing? How you doing, uh, Usami? You doing all right? Oh, you haven't made any poos yet. I am a, I am a clean, pretty girl. Aw, <laughs> oh, okay, well, there's much to see here. <laughs> run, Hajime, run! Oh, yeah, the, that isn't fucking terrifying. Yeah, like, I would walk into that. Oh! Oh, my God, it's fucking breathing, too. Oh! <laughs> Come on! Get here, Hajime! Get inside me! I don't know. I'm not gonna do it if you say it like that. Do what? Get inside me! <laughs> deeper! Deeper! A plushy factory? This is where I sell all my medical memorabilia! Right, smoke, smoke is billowing from the building in the back. Is this some kind of factory? It's got Monokuma's face on it. I'm sure it's a shady factory anyway. Hajime. <laughs> Hajime. Oh, Hajime. Good timing. Oh, by the way, I figured out apparently that little thing. I've been wondering what the fuck is that little hairpin she has. But it's like a little Galaga spaceship hairpin. <laughs> I was like, oh my god, that's awesome. Just makes Chiaki even more fucking amazing. What's up, Chiaki? See? This building clearly looks suspicious, right? I was, um, I was thinking it might be good if I thoroughly look around inside, but well, since it clearly looks suspicious, I thought it'd be dangerous to go alone. Then do you want to go inside together? Mm -hmm. Kitty hat. <laughs> I'm surprised you didn't say, okay. <laughs> hey, hey. I'm surprised you didn't say, hey, hey. Why are you hesitating? Uh, because, you know, it's a giant version of Monokuma breathing on us. <laughs> oh, yeah, there is that. There's two doors. Factory. Oh, what's this one? You. Hey, Hachima, you're kind of pushed to waste until the very end to eat their favorite food, aren't you? 
Uh, how could you tell? Well, I like to eat my favorite foods first. See? <laughs> so instead of the warehouse, let's start with the factory. I guess you're right. <laughs> ah, come on. I want to. You go first. You go to the place you don't think you're supposed to go to. There might be shit in there, you know. That's how you. That's how an RPG a person who plays RPGs thinks. All right, then I'm going inside. I immediately just get shot. Oh fuck! Oh good, I can. I get my plushie collection here. Oh my god, look at all the plushies. What the heck is this? It's being manufactured after. <laughs> uh, oh man, I can easily complete my collection here. It's being manufactured one after the other. Was being carried away on a conveyor belt. Was. Monokuma. Oh. 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 No, these are the. These are the fucking actual Monokuma bots. Not not the uh, the plushies. I don't think. I don't think. Gabriel is endlessly moving through this enormous factory. God, how many versions of him? Are, do they need this many versions of him? Damn right you do. The coconut tree carried by the conveyor belts is processed and eventually made into this stupid thing. Oh! <laughs> I didn't even see that back there. You're right. What the fuck? How on the fuck am I made of coconuts? <laughs> Woo! Oh, I see one on the sitting on the top there. That's that's gotta be. Monkeys are being tossed in this giant basket one after another. It better not be real. I pick one up with my hand. I see. So these are plushies. Mm -hmm. Monokuma plushies. Oh, the real Monokuma is sort of like a plushie too. But with my cam, these are. Probably actual plushies. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, hold on! This is the resemblance of Kenny! They're my life size plushies! Like the ones you've been going this whole time! Right, Hunchman? Right? Right? Yes! Okay, Jesus. <laughs> life size plushies. Woo! <laughs> I was playing to hit the big time with these! That's why I'm making them I'm crazy! Yahoo! Oh, I'm gonna be rich! <laughs> <laughs> but you made way too many. You're gonna be overstocked when it's all said and done. I want to give a life size plushie. I don't want it. I say as I've been collecting mm. all of them. Mm, I see. So this is for manufacturing life-size monocular plushies. What kind of messed up pla- What kind of messed up place is this man? <laughs> what? Hey, don't look down on me! Wait, why did I- oh, That was weird. Wait, why did I leave and then come right back again? Do you really think it's just a life life-size plushies? <laughs> oh, there's a lot more monocular merch in the warehouse next door. Hey, hey. Go buy my merch! Hey, hey, what should we do? I do kind of want to buy myself some merch. <laughs> Me too. No, honestly, I don't really feel like going. But still. But what if there's some other important clue? What are you going to do? Uh, you're right. God dang it. <laughs> I, I, I forgot my posture. Motherfucker. Stupid fucking cute. Hey, people. <laughs> we should go there for just a little while. Okay, this one's totally right. You. Yeah, I knew it. Once I stood out a little bit. Kind of, what the fuck is he doing? He's got like a remote and a claw and headphones on. <laughs> what am I looking like right now? Ooh, hey, there's a door. Oh, let's go to the break room. Let's see, the break room is outside this door. Sounds like a place for housewives to gossip, but it doesn't like there's anyone in this factory. Oh, come on, why don't we go in there? Oh, we, we're gonna go check out the other thing, but not gonna check out that. That's what more shit dodge me. I still don't understand how the pine. <laughs> how I'm. How I'm getting made from a coconut tree. How is that working? Where's the wood in this design? That's gonna be a hard plushie. <laughs> I've got all the money, but you got Without thinking, I picked up the pile of stacked up cardboard boxes. Hey, look, there's Monokuma uh, 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 signs or something. Russell Russell. Hey, it's the Monokuma calendar. Monokuma sandbag. And even a Monokuma guitar. <laughs> It ain't easy being a big fuzzy pushy on a thunder lady ball on face. When I was young, I used to be a polar bear, and I made it with a black bear and became Monokuma. <laughs> it's just Monokuma over there playing his guitar. <laughs> Monokuma, what, what, what are you doing? I don't, I don't know. Shut up! I, I was working on that for a long time. 
Super Super Monica Mario Archive in the fun house. There's a plushy factor in all these goods. How full of himself is he? <laughs> oh, I love scaring the crap out of you. I love scaring the crap out of Nico, though, even more. <laughs> Mr. Popular doesn't last forever. I got in the big lips when I can. I got that isn't popular anymore. It's like a piece of candy without any sugar. No more so that's no reason for existing. <laughs> Did you read my mind or something? Start talking even crazier. Crazier. Oh, whoa, 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 this is weird. Okay, instead of rotating, I'm like, I'm like side strafing. Woo, woo. Monokuma panel. It's like Monokuma panel. Why so many? I'm just gonna use these to decorate the doors and sell my merch and make them all look, make them all look all boom. Then they stand out, you know? No stores sell your you're stuff. So of course not. You're such a fool. A foolish fool. So I'll open an official Monokuma shop. Then I'll I'm thinking about opening chains all over the world. Of course, the main attraction will be my last size Monokuma plushie. I can't believe you thought that in the future. If far, that far in the future when you made these. Or is this is doomed to fail. Hey. Enough already. You have no business sense anyway. Just so just. No, no. Hey, hey, don't say that. Let's do our best together. We'll be as popular as, as Pogs were in the 90s. Oh, oh damn, you're here. Remember those things? God, those things were fucking ridiculously popular. What were they even for? I mean, they were just like collections, right? I think you actually play a game with them, but like, I never figured that shit out. You just buy the Pogs and then you're like, what do I do with them? What am I doing? <laughs> Um, don't you remember how long this... Um, don't you remember how long this stay popular? Besides, if you're serious about opening a business, you've already committed a major mistake. Because there is no much of me, the most popular person here. My little sister. Oh, mother me, my little sister. Don't you know the Aesop's fable about the rabbit and the bear? Not to do it, it's... <laughs> um, a long, long time ago, there were these two old guys. <laughs> two old guys living together. <laughs> what? <laughs> that, 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 that's the surprising part of the story? Why, why am I flipping out about that? The old guy saw rabbits are as popular as bears. The end! Who, uh, 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 did you even need the old guys in that story? In other words... So he found me a merger, you would spoil us! <laughs> I've been grabbing so late! You know you have one ounce of good fashion sense! You stupid brother! You did this to me! You're the one who has no fashion sense! Remember, stupid? Oh! <laughs> Oh, oh, is this, uh... Am I referencing One Piece? Is this, uh, Luffy's thing where he's like, goes, Bugga, 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 Or something else, maybe? Yeah! Pow! Right in the kisser! Oh, oh, poor Monami. Aura! He's saying Aura, so maybe not. It's like... I don't know, there's that one boxing manga, I can't remember what they call it. Uh, oh, Hajime. I, I, it's actually Hajime no Ito or something. I, honestly, I can't feel like. I can't help but feel like I've made too many panels. <laughs> Whoever wants to stick with the room, please do as much as you like. Here. Come on, what are you waiting for? <laughs> what are you waiting for? Hajime, let's run. You're right! But I can check the room for any plushies. Oh, we ran out of the warehouse, narrowly avoiding the Monokuma's plan for inventory disposal. Oh my god. Oh my god, we almost didn't make it. Oh, there better not have been a plushie that I'm really fucking pissed. It's like, he just got tired. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> I'm gonna go back. Oh, good, okay, I can't. Because I swear to god, if there's a freaking plushie in here, and I missed it, I'm gonna be mad. So, I don't see one though. Random goods. Put your corporate box down on top of each other. Various goods set them, or even hospital appliances and musical instruments. Price for shipping, packaging goods. Looks like they're waiting to be shipped, but I don't. But I don't. These are ever going. To, I don't think these are ever going to leave the island. God dang, the typos are so. It's just numerous in this game. It's ridiculous. Like they just. They. Didn't, I think they just went over one time. They're like, you know what? That's good. Enough. <laughs> yeah. Don't care. Fuck typos. Don't give a shit. <laughs> Don't give a fuck. There's a bunch of books stacked up high. What in the world are these? Monokuma's poetry collection? You stupid, who the hell's gonna read these? Hey, hey. <laughs> hey, hey, there's another book here too. Let's see. Monokuma's Most Precious see? Moments. That's the actual title of this book, but it's a, but it's a collective nude photos. <laughs> <laughs> of me! <laughs> Monokuma's already naked. Yep. Uh, I know. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit, check out the size of my dick. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This is the picture of me flexing! 
<laughs> like when he was earlier, remember? <laughs> oh yeah, remember when I did that? All this active stuff is a bunch of CDs. <laughs> oh, puffy face! I thought these were gonna be video games, but they're just music CDs. Son of a bitch! Jackie says, Monica has a collection of songs and ballads. Is he playing really an album? Mm, counter songs are all the raise these days, but I'm not all that interested in derivative works like that. Never heard of a mask that's singing his own character songs. Mm. Yeah, apparently it's like a Japanese thing, like, right? Like, where, like, characters from, like, anime or something will connect. Because, like, like, a lot of the voice actors can also, like, sing, too. And, uh, they, like, release their own singles for the characters or something. I think it's one. I think we were actually seeing it, seeing one, and I thought it was really funny. It was, like, Aizen, Aizen singing, Aizen song is song. <laughs> I was like, I was like, what? <laughs> oh, Aizen. I'm gonna sing you a song about butterflies. Plus, it looks like he's already produced his 100th song. See, the 100th track is a festive, like a pop dance rap that he performs with all his might. I don't even know where to begin. <laughs> oh! Okay, well, that was fun. It's like a concentration camp or something? Holy shit! Oh my, oh my god, it's a freaking military base! Woo! Oh, I got some helicopters! Oh, that's where I got the helicopter to fuck up Tay Terror! I doused them in butter and and feathers or paste and feathers. I don't know, something like that. The thing over there. Is it a fuck? Is it a motherfucking tank? Oh, here we go, dude. Now we don't. Dude, we gotta use that shit to fuck up the mana beast. Oh damn! I really wish I knew to known about this section of the island. Is it real? Is that? There's a lot of other stuff here. That looks really dangerous. Man, this place is boring. Boring. What are you talking about? There's a fucking tank over there. You. Oh, I like strong dudes. Well, no, it's not me at all. Mm. Don't make my nipples all hard. <laughs> a real man fights with his fist. <laughs> That's right, Minnie Morrow. That goes for women too. All right. You want to battle a little? You win. You can rest on my boot pillows. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> all right. <laughs> oh my god. Did she like just? She's like oh, totally aware that like everybody loves my boobies. <laughs> No thanks. Boob -bo pillows? My boobs, duh! Put your face in them, just. I, I don't even have to win, just go ahead and put your face in them, I don't care. So it appears to be a military base. Is that so? Despite the fact this island is quite small, the military technology here seems rather extensive. Alright! This, this might prove useful when the time comes to combat the future foundation. Useful? There's no way we'd be able to operate stuff like tanks and heavy weapons. Huh? Wait. Huh? Really? In my country, even a child in grace who could operate a tank, no problemo. <laughs> what? <laughs> no problem. <laughs> um, of course, in modern warfare, it is re in modern warfare is a required class in all our great schools. Your obsession with anime and not this. So this country never ceases to baffle me. However, <laughs> However, weapons are only weapons when humans start to use them. I am concerned. If no one uses them, then they are nothing more than scrap metal. You're right. Unfortunately, this stuff in the base probably won't be useful. Please us. wait. No, that is wrong. Huh? Um. Well, I've discovered a puzzling document in the tank op seat operator seat. That's the future foundation. The yeah, uh, foundation's insignia. Jabberwock Island Development Plan. What is this? However, I assume it belongs to Monokuma, and it was placed rather ostentatiously. I do not know how much we can trust it. Do you think it'd be a useful clue? Monokuma probably did leave it. Like you said, it's hard to know how much we can trust it. So what does it say? Um, beyond what is written in here, I do not know much. Well? But it does document Jabberwock Island's re redevelopment at a plan at a considerable length. What is that plan? So we shall walk under the Future Foundation's control and prepare it as a central headquarters. Central headquarters for the Future Foundation? I thought Jabberwock Island was a tourist destination. Why would the Future Foundation be issued in it? Um, next watch, there was something written here that caught my attention. I guess preparing it for us, I suppose, for why we're here. The travel, travel agency that managed Jabberwock Island went bankrupt, so the island was uninhabited for a long time. Because of that, the island was unaffected by the by the incident, which allowed them to easily gain a foothold. Wait, hold on. This was uninhabited for a long time. If that's true. The maintenance here has has been way too attentive. The items in the supermarket are always stocked. The hotel's really still really clean. Does that be future foundation's responsibility? More important, what's the incident? What does that mean? What does it mean that the island, island was unaffected by? It? We, that's right. Do, I can't remember. Do we know about the? Uh, I think we do, don't we? Didn't Monica bring up the most awful, horrible thing in the history? Blah blah blah. Probably. I discern that from this passage alone. Simply reading this will not help me grasp what those words mean. Well? However, there is one more thing that caught my attention. <laughs> There's more? 
Do you remember hey, the guidebook at Chapel Hill in the library? Yeah. Um, it was written there that Central Island Beat House is a large administrative building. However, we could not find that building anywhere. We even commented on how strange that was, right? Yeah. But according to this plan, the building that the Future Foundation is planning to use for the headquarters... Could it be that same um, building? They are planning to rebuild it and use it as the Future Foundation's headquarters. Or so it is written. What the heck? It's so inconsistent. How do you rebuild a building that doesn't exist? Damn, what the frick? What's going on here? Well, maybe they rebuilt it and it's hidden underground or something. Maybe that's what that thing's counting down to. Isn't that where it was supposed to be? Where that big statue of the ball, ball is? So they want to say that goes down, then, yeah... They'll like rise out of the ground or something like the Legion of Doom. Meanwhile, at, at the Future Foundation's Future Foundation headquarters, we should distract about the horrible situation that could happen one to the other. We might have overlooked a more pressing issue. And that is the mystery of this island. What's really going on? This mystery doesn't make any sense. No matter how much we think about it, there's no reason behind it. In the freaking pretty butt. Check out this truck. What the truck? Oh, I see you. <laughs> hey, you look at my RPGs there, Hodge Bay. Oh, come on, grab it! Grab my missile! No. It's a military truck. It's not in the cargo box. Firearms? There's a ton of them. Okay, come on. This shit's gotta be fucking useful. <laughs> in some way. F fucking weapons! Mmm! There's a lot of different weapons, like guns, anti-rocket... Anti-tank rockets, carelessly stacked in here. Is alright? Handle these carelessly? <laughs> oh! <laughs> I see you. Damn it! Oh, I thought I was so well hidden. I knew you could do what it. What is on my arm right now? I've got a, I've got a remote control attached to my arm and a, a headphone attached. Oh, are they attached to my nipples? Where are they going? Man, check out this helicopter. Helicopter? Do we use this to fly out of the island, right? Oh, it is actually the uh, the helicopter used on Terror Terror. He's, he's what he used to execute Terror Terror. <laughs> I don't believe it. Stop that. This helicopter. Don't screw with me. Bam. Ow. Uh, Punching me? What happened? It's nothing. I'm fine. I'm not punching it, but I just ended up hurting my fist. <laughs> Punch me! What are you doing? Damn it! I'm so weak. <laughs> I'm so weak. Oh, how did you stop punching the helicopter? It's a tank, right? Is it real? Can it move? I was waiting on a. For some reason, I was just waiting on Monaco to pop out right then. Okay. This place has, okay, I'm pretty sure that we can definitely use that shit for something, you know? Come on, it's a fucking tank. Can we use the helicopter to fly out of here? I mean, I don't know. I know we don't know how to fly a helicopter, but we could try. We could fucking try. Seeking Industries. What? Does it look like a face? Kind of like a, whoa, 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 what the, what, oh. Hey, check out where the mono beasts are. I see another pollution plushie in the back. A bunch of strange machines line up in all directions. It's very sci-fi. Hmm. Seeking Industries. Huh? Huh? Their company has specialized in manufacturing electrical ins electric insulation and other machine parts. The rest of this company that only, with only 100 employees, with the biggest coal region on Jabberwock Island. This place looks like a research facility. For a mid-sized company, this is a pretty nice facility. Uh. I guess so. I only read about them on a pamphlet next to the reception desk. That is, the size of the company isn't the true oh, issue no. here. This company obviously doesn't make machine parts, so what the heck are they making here? So they're making the mono beasts. Right, so they're making something more dangerous. So we might be going to thoroughly investigate this place. I see you. Get over here. I'm Wolverine! Huh? Are you serious? I have got... Why do I have things attached to... Cores attached to my nipples? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> So we should get a hold of yourself! Get a hold of yourself! Huh? Hey, why? Why? Because you start to laugh all of a sudden. <laughs> well, obviously. Well, I was gonna do no to laugh. I mean, it's just so childish. What are you talking yeah. about? Well, there was a computer over there, I, so I started snooping around to see if I could find the clues. Whoever's using this computer must have been sending emails to his buddy or something. <laughs> <laughs> he was probably trying to write a manga or something. He said one of the story ideas of his buddy. It's such a horrible delusional story. It was an, I was so embarrassed to read it, it gave me goosebumps. Delusional story. So, what was written in the email, anyway? Well, I'll start with the idea for the story. Apparently, global riots are occur occurring in various regions around the world. And these riots were caused by high school students. I mean, seriously, that's not realistic at all. Yeah. Didn't we talk about this earlier? I can't remember if we... T did we not bring it up in front of them? I thought, like, in the second trial, or... Or before, even before the second trial, it was like, Monokuma brought up the most horrible incident or whatever, and maybe we haven't... Yeah, I don't know. I thought, I thought we already knew all about this. 
So these rats just keep growing, so people grow more dissatisfied and frustrated with society. Till eventually spread like an infectious disease all over the world. Which mm. of the rats start starts getting circulated and strange and start growing one after another. Hopeless anxiety instantly spreads throughout the world as the end of the world gets closer and closer. End of the world? <laughs> I know rats are like a late high school band would think of it as some kind. Whoever wrote this needs to come up with a better story idea, because this wasn't realistic at all. Not at all, not at all, not at all, not at all. <laughs> I mean, students causing a riot and that skill's totally impossible. I never believe her a second. I learned a valuable life lesson today. I should always delete embarrassing emails right away. Hey, about that. <laughs> I sure it's good to say that it's just a made up story. <laughs> uh, of course. I mean, don't realize things might happen in real life from time to time. Of course not. <laughs> yeah, well, you mean like uh, everything that's happened on this fucking island? <laughs> no way it's real. It's more possible than a notebook that kills people just by writing it. It's more possible than a group of high school students getting brought on an island and forced to murder one another. You're right. That's totally not true. There's a lot of unimaginable things keep happening to us. So I'm, maybe I'm getting a little confused, but the world ending there's no way something un un so unbelievable could actually happen. Hey, Monokuma Beast. This machine's making another machine. This probably looks like it's modeled after a four legged animal. A legged animal. Hey, hey. Hey, doesn't that animal look like the machine mind use anything? Are you talking about the Mono Beast? Maybe. There are chances those model beasts were created here. Fine, fine. Yep, that's what this is for! No matter how much you insist in the game, people will be convinced of this. Like this doesn't, ex like this doesn't exist, fine. right? That's why it's just fine! There's something wrong with you. What the hell do you mean by that? It wasn't making any sense at all. I mean, no matter who's convinced, who's convinced, because I'll never be convinced. What's going never. on? Never! place for the manufacturing machine parts. Why are they able to create such dangerous robots in a place like that? Did Monokuma turn over this place and modify to do this? Damn, I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. What the freaking pretty fuck is that? Oh! Ooh, what the hell? It's making a person and doing a very bad job. T Damn it, face keeps falling off. Ah, fuck. What? Oh, no. I'm telling you, someone's gonna end up being a robot in this game. Don't tell me this game's gonna pull a fucking Luna on me. Just break my sh shatter my heart into fucking pieces. Wait, who have we encountered any robots like this? Or maybe she looks like he's making something. Is this a mannequin? Maybe. It's a human or machines, not a robot. Are you serious? Seriously, how can they make robots? <laughs> <laughs> hey, just how far technology is without me knowing. Oh my god, have I been blacked out for fucking decades? I think Nikamara was made here. Oh, oh nice. right, of course. <laughs> Duh! Damn, Nico took a while to remember that one. It's a similar home humanoid robot. It's possible, maybe. Hey, hey, hey. Why would a company that manufactures machine bars have access to this kind of technology? I don't know. This place somehow connected to the Future Foundation, too. <laughs> well, anyway, it's clear now, isn't it? Uh, what's clear? Uh, this used to be a seeking stream. It's not anymore. The sound became uninhabited. Makuma took over and not without permission. He had all this, to, all this to shock us. That's the reason. That's right. It's not so weird the whole time he's been doing similar stuff to us. But why? This is bad. Maybe there's a bunch of crazy rich dudes are into this stuff, you know? <laughs> They're the ones who make us kill each other. They're about to get a bunch of kids killing each other. They're, they're paying all of you. Hey, hey, hey. Wait, hold on. Now that they say that last, we're actually a terrible assumption. Oh. I mean, that's true. There's no face in the hands of those rich furred bastards. <laughs> this is like something that would happen in a portrait fiction. <laughs> Call Tongue on Earth but one. The thought of it actually happening in reality is really is definitely unsettling. <laughs> oh my god, we're all gonna die. We're all gonna die. Yo. Hey guys, man, I was looking for you. I guess it must have been the last place. How you doing there, Sami? She hasn't pooed yet. Yeah, does she not make poos anymore? <laughs> I, I'm too pretty to make poo. So Fuhiko. What? I was thinking you'd probably finish exploring this island by now. <laughs> man, I just know I I timed that shit perfectly, didn't I? Yeah, how'd you do that? You're right, I think I've explored everywhere at least for Damn right. once in that for now. <laughs> Damn right. <laughs> Damn straight. Now you think, nah, then do you want to meet up with everyone and discuss things? Yeah, I don't huh. mind. I think it'd be annoying if we all went back to the hotel for this. There's a street nearby line with food vendors, so I told everyone to meet Later. up there. Meet over there right now. Hurry up and come over. If you could, let me know if you could love the area. You actually took the time to tell everyone about that, huh? Well, that's not really the time to be impressed by something like that. Better make the others wish. Turn over to the street with food stands. All right. Yep, that was it. Let's do it. Fuck your city. 
there's only six of us left. <laughs> it just keeps hitting me like, oh my god, really getting down here to the nitty gritty. All right, looks like everyone's here. Huh? Oh, what about Nagito? Oh wait, no, I forgot to commit. <laughs> I can't forget about me, Nico. I'm the most important character in this fucking game. Yeah, no, you're not. <laughs> yeah, shut up, yes I am. I'm, the, I'm so fucking relevant. You know, like running the Shurige. Yes, I, I'm so relevant. Don't forget me. <laughs> and the Aya guy. Aya, you suck. Oh, uh, what about Nagito? Who cares, Nagito's got friend or anything. Right. I'm gonna get in touch with him. I don't know where the hell he is or what he's doing. Now then. Probably coming up with some fucked up scheme to fuck us up. So, how, so how'd it go? Did you learn anything about the Future Foundation? Mm. Well, not really. Like, I, I feel like I learned stuff, but I also feel like I didn't learn anything. Not clear which information we found is believable, if any. However, however, I believe there is no question the Future Foundation is behind everything that's been going on. Well, wow. are you sure about that? Are I, are you sure about that? Huh? huh? What? What are you saying? They're not the enemy. Then what are they? If they're our, if they're our allies, why do we travel to this island? Oh yeah. That's true, but that, that, that's true, but there's nothing something I've been thinking about. Hey. Monokuma works for the Future Foundation, right? She's pretty much admitted by this point. But even though Monokuma is forcing us to kill each other, Monokuma has been opposing him. Huh? You mean pretending to oppose him? That's pretending wrong. to oppose him, right? No, I don't think she's pretending. They clearly hate each other. Yeah. Th uh, thank you, finally. I I don't think... Hmm. It's possible that the enemy of our enemy is actually an ally. Because she opposes Monokuma, you think she's our ally? Please wait. Even if they oppose one another, it is... Is it not possible that they are both our enemy? Starting to get pumped up. Like a three-way tact about. Oh, that's kind of hot. Mm, my nipples are getting hard. Mm, we want to see hot me? No, get them out of my face. Hey. Huh. Why, after all this time, you suddenly bagging on the Future Foundation. Whoa. I'm talking like that because you're actually the traitor that's working for them. <laughs> Don't be a fucking idiot. I swear to God, I am going to fucking murder you, Kazuki. Stop saying stupid bullshit. I won't be fooled. No way, you're clear switch. I mean, if you don't, I'm better. Kazuchi, shut the fuck up! Uh, Kazuchi Soda, shut up, bitch! <laughs> oh, oh, <laughs> yes! I'm sorry, please, Sonia, please forgive me, I love you! Listen! There was never a traitor. Monokuma lied to oh, us. Oh, my. Lied? Well? It is simply a false entity that Monokuma made so up so we would be suspicious of each other. Well, I guess that's a possibility. You insolent fool! How can you not believe in your friends after everything we have endured together? Uh... Probably <laughs> weak. How weak? Probably. Oh, yeah, I knew it. Man. <laughs> Instead of facing the problem directly and overcoming, you're desperately trying to run away. <laughs> what a bunch of losers. <laughs> Commander, what are you doing here? I was just grabbing some Chinese food. Mmm. P.F. Chang's, baby. It's almost as good as bagels. Ha! <laughs> almost. Such despair. That weakness is is hopeless. Ah, Commander! Oh, Jesus! Now, where have you even been this whole time? Jeez. Oh, I wonder where your thought process wandered off to. As usually, you guys just keep running around in circles. What are you, hamsters? Ha, <laughs> get it? Because <laughs> Tanaka's dead. Oops, I can fucking bear you guys to hamsters. Will I get yelled at that, but that weakling who dropped out? That is. What is that? Now then. <laughs> now then. Every time, every time I say that, I sound like Igor. You asked where I've been this whole time. Right, right. <laughs> well, I was in the middle of, of looking for someone. Looking for someone? <sighs> I thought that person might have already arrived, but I guess I was wrong. <laughs> or maybe that person is hiding in a secret location and carefully watching us. You... Hey, who are you talking about? Are you saying there's someone else on the island beside us? <laughs> <laughs> it's probably the survivor of the killing school life. Huh? Huh? How about it? If so, a lot of things might start adding up, don't you think? What? Are you... Oh, are you talking about Tagami? He's the survivor you're talking about, right? What? Huh? <laughs> Oh, I see. You guys only reached that stage. What stage? You're not making any sense at all. What? Well, that. Oh, wait. So are we? Are we? Why don't we like saying that the other thing I'm most real or something now? All of a sudden? That's what I was sense. thinking. <laughs> not making sense. Jeez. Ugh, who the hell said that? It's like Mini Maru. Oh, look how adorable he is. <laughs> now die. <laughs> so much hope that I will destroy. <laughs> Still, if you think about it properly, you might be able to figure it out. Why would Tagami, a survivor of the killing school life, die in vain like he did at the very beginning? Right? Don't you think it's strange? Oh, thank you, sweet mother of God, for fucking bringing it up! <sighs> oh, okay, I'm sorry, I'm just... Oh, oh, that's just been driving me bananas for so long. Excuse me, so... Wait, so long to get the answer to this! Huh? What does that mean? That is an order! That issue is not what he means. Please take back what you said about Tagami dying in vain. That's right! Yeah, listen to me, Sonya. Well? Shut up, Kazuichi. <laughs> okay. 
have been acting very strangely lately. I do not like this first Nagato we have been witness to. <laughs> even, even more so than the other Nagato. Huh. I don't like you either. Well, I never liked you in the first place, though. This is trouble. Oh, uh, looks like I'm being hated. Well, that's understandable. There's no way you guys can even comprehend my suffering. Knowing the truth would be pretty painful in its own way. The truth? What truth? What do you know? Tell me! <laughs> uh, curious, are you? But why don't I tell you guys after we found out who the traitor is? Huh? Actually, to tell you the truth, I still haven't figured out who the traitor is. <laughs> traitor is, but it won't take very long. You guys don't have to worry. I'll weed out the traitor, even if it costs me my life. What? You're going to weed out the traitor? Please wait. As I already said, there is no traitor. <laughs> I'll bend the end. You're just gonna raise your hand and go, "I'm actually a traitor, right?" <laughs> I, I'm gone that shit. <laughs> <laughs> You're a funny guy, Kazuichi, <laughs> loser. <laughs> but why don't I tell you guys after the, that that after we found out who the traitor is, if I'm able to wipe out all the spear on this island, will I? This is exciting. Will I become the ultimate bagel? I mean, hope. Wait, what did I say? <laughs> ultimate hope. Ooh. The hell are you talking about? You finally lost your damn mind. Now then. <laughs> now then. <laughs> now then. I should get going. But if you see Monokuma again, there's something I want to tell him. I want you to tell him. Tell him he doesn't need to provide a motive anymore. Huh? <laughs> Tell him not to worry, because I'm planning to go all out. Besides, the next one will probably be the last. Be the last. What does that mean? Bye now. Bye? Is he planning to die? He seems quite sure he's... I'm going to go murder myself. Now, you know, is he trying to, like, lure... So he's trying to lure him out with... His death or something? Is that that's what it sort of sounds like? Nagido ignored Chiaki's question and left. We were powerless to stop him. It was clear to us that trying to stop him would just be useless. Hey, hey. I don't want to think about it, but uh could he be planning planning to kill? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? <laughs> kill who? Who's, who's gonna kill? I don't think he was gonna it didn't sound like he was gonna kill one of us. It sounded like he was gonna kill himself. Damn it. That's not how he's talking. It looks like his target is a traitor. <laughs> There's no such person. Oh, okay. Well, maybe. He yeah. just said he was going to give up his life, though, right? Well, maybe. Okay. There is no such person. I mean, the notion that one of us has been deceiving us all along. I will never, ever believe that. Oh, Aw, Sean. Yeah, it's okay. That's what I said. I couldn't believe that either. I don't think any of us can do that. Well, what if it's Nagito? Or what if whoever it is has forgotten about it? What if the traitor has forgotten that they're the traitor? Just like how I forgot that I don't have a talent. Uh. Yeah. That's why I still think it could actually still be Hajime, you know? And he just doesn't realize it, but... I guess it could also be one of these guys. Well, regardless of who he's targeting, there's a hot chance that he's playing to kill us, right? right? We got a time up, force him to stop his own way! Oh. It's impossible, Nick and not even here anymore. I'll show you my serious side! Yeah, I got one Tixty with someone as weak as him! Yeah, to be honest, I think I kinda probably can handle that. I'm here too! I'm here too! Mini mode to save the day! Then that's a yes, right? Just leave it to me. Once I come up with a plan, we'll meet up again. Tap Nagito, huh? Kazuji's right. Seems to let Nagito run water freely. If we're being cautious, we have to act fast. But what is this indescribable anxiousness I'm feeling? I hope it just means I'm thinking too much. Yeah, oh, fucking fuck. We're, we are all gonna die. For the time being, we decided to finish our exploration of the final island and return to the hotel. Sorry, dark by the time we return to the hotel. Meta! Oh, there's Sonya. I, I believe that there is no trade. Have a minute? No, that that is not the issue. After all, this is impossible. Well? Why does Nagito not understand that? Furthermore, he made, even made an insulting remark about uh. Gundam. Gundam gave his life so he could teach us something important. Uh. Sonya. At the time, Gundam scolded me for attempting to stop his execution. But looking back on it, he would forgive me with a smile on his face, right? Yeah, definitely. Uh. He loved you. <laughs> Gundam stayed true to himself until the very end. I will never forget that. I'll do Nick Ma shift the ground. Leave it to me. I break out by my strength. As long as nobody grabs my tail, there won't be any problems. <laughs> what are you, Goku? <laughs> you have a tail? I say I'm joking. Obviously. <laughs> Obviously. I see. Don't we say things stuff like, if you want to see tail, I gotta grab one. I got one if you grab it. Wait, what? If you so. <laughs> what? <laughs> I wasn't thinking of that. <laughs> Until now, <laughs> whip out my man's night. Go, go, horny, hide your man. Do, 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 do. <laughs> I got one in walk. <laughs> <laughs> hey, 
you gave him more more power. <laughs> she's just like cracking like that's a terrible joke. See worse than worse than a joke an old man would make. I've actually got a penis, don't I? <laughs> oh god dang it. Jeez. Even geez, even even her ignorance has limit. I keep getting I keep fucking up uh for some reason my my Kazuichi and my Kuzuru. Even her her ignorance has limit. What are you talking about this time? Sonya, she had the nerve to say she wanted to check out my body. <laughs> huh? Your body? Don't think about weird things, you bastard. <laughs> what was it like that? I, I, <laughs> it's kind of funny seeing Kuzuru blush. I don't know where she heard it from, but Kimbo came in and said, Real Kuzuru supposed to have tattoos, so show them to me. Uh oh, so that's what it was. <laughs> it's not funny for her to tell me to strip right in front of her. What is she, who does she think she is? Besides, tattoos aren't supposed to be gawked at. So what if I got a tattoo on my testicles? So what? I don't show that to everybody. Right, touch me. Huh? Wait, yeah, yeah. You wanna see it? No! <laughs> nah. <laughs> I can lick gaze of my amazing plushies. Oh, I've only got two left. Unless that top, there might be actually, actually might be another row up there. For some reason, I feel really tired today. Since I walked around all day today, today I, all day today, I was able to obtain some clu several clues, although it's not really certain if you can call these clues. So I feel like we're just suffering from more mysteries that don't make sense. This isn't good. As soon as the nighttime hits, I can't stop thinking all these pessimistic thoughts. This might be a bad habit of mine. She says, I should just get some sleep for today, rest of mine for a while. But then I'll get this some more thought tomorrow. Sleep. Oh! <laughs> God dang it, it's like dream about Monokuma Theater. Oh! Actually, words are extremely dangerous. I'm like letters, words gotta be under where the razors are over the backspace. That's why you need to be extremely careful. Same goes for me. There was a time in the past when I went through a lot of trouble because of that. That's right. I was being trained at the safari park. At the time, there were two animals in the park that I got along with. One was a squirrel named Doc, named Senor D Dietrich, and the other was a fox named named Chacha Junior. <laughs> to be honest, Chacha Junior was really stupid. A female employee tried to have a serious talk with him. He just stared at her boobs the whole time. <laughs> That's why Senor Dietrich would order him to steal panties. God, these, these stories are getting weirder and weirder. Are they just like totally random? Are they just, like anything to do with anything? That idiot would get really happy when he exchanged the panties he stole for Dietrich's old undies. Also, this one time, the three of us went up to a steakhouse and the waiter asked, How would you like it cooked? Chacha's proud, Junior's proudly said, Wait fire! <laughs> Senor Dietrich was pretty crafty. He knew how to play Chacha Junior. He said, Chacha Junior. He made Chacha Junior duck duck a, fa a fawn and drown it, and then save that drowning fawn himself. <laughs> he made, and he made Chacha Junior tell everyone about it. Man, he did some really shady things. Anyway, the three of us were getting along together. We were living in a fun life, fun life in the safari park. And that's right until the day I ended up saying those words. Actually said, like, actually said to this to Chacha Junior. Foxes are squirrels, natural enemies. The day I stumbled across what was left of Doc D D D Dietrich Senior, he had been eaten. Got the guy immediately tattled it to a male's employee, so he put down Chacha Junior with a hunting rifle. <laughs> <laughs> Even now, I regret saying that when I, what I, I regret saying what I said back then. Jeez, screws have a rough. They've, they've so many natural enemies. 